Hello everyone and welcome back to uh welcome back to Radiant Arc. I think last time yeah, I think we have to get through this um this like little mini cave right now. So let's go ahead and do that. Um everyone is healed up. Hmm. Okay. How many arrows do we have, by the way? I, I just realized that I have not checked this in quite a while. Oh, it doesn't say in here? Oh, it's probably just uh, just um, items I can use. I have a uh, 52. Okay, that's fine. That might kill them all. So there's a lawnmower outside. How come, like, every time I record is like the- I, I know other YouTubers who deal with this too. Like, when I start recording, that's when people start doing stuff outside. Like, <laughs> it's kind of funny how that works. Oh, that was short. Okay. Well, regardless, there's the place we need to go. There's, like, a red thing down there. Uh, I think the- I think these are new enemies. Are they all in the same row? I think they are. Oh, we got a mushroom for that. Or did we not? Interesting. A mushroom popped out of that guy, but I didn't get it. Uh, yeah, whatever. Oh, that's like a mini boss. And it, I guess if I beat it, um, I'll get access to this place. Or, no, no, no. Th oh, this is a shortcut. Hmm. What level am I? Level four. I'm going to go ahead and try it. Okay. We got skeleton warriors. Hmm. That increases attack. I'm gonna go ahead and use that. We're gonna have magic for now, so I can just keep using this. And didn't I learn a few new things for you? There is a mage amongst them, so maybe that could be useful. Oh, oh! I can't target it because it's in the back row. You know what I was what I was gonna do there though. Mabon, Arbon, and Wabon. Also, they're all in separate rows, so that was a waste of magic right there. Oh, they are weak to light, though. I like how the apple juice is its own status ailment. That's funny. <laughs> that should be able to kill. Oh, it didn't. Hmm. You can only cast that once? Interesting. I guess I'll get more magic later. And just do- Ah, dang it, I used the wrong skill again. That guarantees the next attack is critical, right? Oh, there we go. Oh, that wasn't too bad. And I'm assuming that unlocks, like, a little bit of a shortcut. 
Uh, yep, yeah, that's an open chest. We have been here before, so yeah, that is exactly what that does. That's kind of cool. <laughs> I like little roadblocks like that. Well, here we are. Um, Guild of Light. Oh my goodness, this town looks neat. Some of these um, assets are original, too. That cafe sign I don't recognize from the RTP. Well, let's ask around, see if we can find, like, a shop or something. With all the monsters everywhere, mercenary groups are starting to form, offering their services to slay monsters for a fee. Also, I thought Guild of Light would be, like, the name of the group. I didn't realize, like, the place, the town was literally called Guild of Light. <laughs> it would be, like, the name of a group within the town. This looks like an accessory shop. Different accessories can provide different benefits. Mix and match to suit your needs. Can we equip multiple accessories? Yes, we can, too. Oh, yes, yes, yes. This is my kind of stuff. Um, Iron necklace. Those are pretty expensive. That lowers magical attack. Or does it? No, no, no. He just has something that increases magical attack. I don't have that increases speed. Nothing here increases speed. Um, let's get this for um, for Lexi, because I do find myself using her magic quite a bit. I still have enough to purchase what I want. We can get one more accessory for her. Just two necklaces. Can we sell anything? Uh, oh, those sell for a lot. Sell prices aren't that bad in this game. Oh, you can't sell those, that's good. They'll sell for six each. That seems a little abusable. I wonder if there's a way to, like, grind for arrows in, like, the dozens and, s and sell them easily. Does not consume turn. That's true for a lot of these items. I, I can cook with some of these though, so maybe I don't want to um maybe I don't want to sell the food items. I feel bad selling weapons, but that I can sell. What else can I give Lexi? You know, I'll hold on on her for now. I feel like we're going to get a lot of accessories in this game, so... Yeah. What's this? Orange stat book. Okay. I mentioned this before, I'm waiting until I get a fourth party member before I use those. Because, like, if I get, like, a super mage, I want to use all of my, um, magical attack raising stuff on that person. The lighting just changed, too, I noticed. Uh, it must be, um... Oh! Oh, I thought I triggered a cutscene for a second. I come here often since it tastes good. Beat, beats my cooking. I, I, I either eat here at the inn if the place gets too busy. Have you tried the pan-fried fish? It can increase your magical attack. Oh my goodness. I love that you can find stuff just all over the place. It really incentivizes actually, like, looking around and talking to people. Speak to my wife in the front to order. Be sure, uh, to, or uh, be sure to order plenty to eat. We get a lot of customers every day. I feel proud to serve the Guild of Light members. Nom nom, so good. <laughs> Heaven steak. This is the only place we can get it. It's great eating and drinking with friends. Okay. We don't have sausages yet.
That's pretty good. Show me one steak that you can eat quickly. Like, that's a, that's a sit-down meal. <laughs> that's, like, basically an elixir, but a little bit better. Is this an inn? Oh, okay. Save point at the end. That makes sense. Right, I see some stuff around here. We don't really need to sleep right now. Yeah. What is the point of the inn if the save points heal you? I just thought of that. Maybe there's, like, something extra you get for doing that. Hmm. Might as well get all the sparkly stuff right while we're here. Wool hat. Let's see if anyone can equip that. Um, less agility, more magical defense. How often do I get hit with magic? I'm gonna put it on you. Welcome to the Iron Inn. It costs 50 gold to spend the night. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Um, oh! Oh, that's what it does. It's like a, it's a way to pass time quickly. Okay, that's clever. Um, <laughs> I didn't really think of that. We're, we're just gonna steal everyone's books. I hope they don't mind. There's more stuff over here. Oh, dang it. Alright, um... Would you like to look at my new weapons? They're brand new. Okay, um... I I'm going all in with Lily, uh, over with Lexi. You have that equipped already. But Lexi can equip swords? Why? That's interesting. And I can't afford anything else. I probably can't afford any new armor now, that, now either. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, there's some good stuff here. Magic Iron Shield. This is Magical Defense. Hmm. I might grind for some gold and buy some stuff later if I feel I need to. Be sure to stop by Heaven's Tavern for great food. Oh, that's a pretty clever secret. <laughs> Let's go way out of your way for a minute and you get something neat out of it. I like that. Get all the oranges you can. Now they're everywhere. That is a pretty transition, by the way, going from evening to night. <laughs> Alright, I think up here. More oranges. Oh, even more oranges. And apples. There's a guy up there. Can I find a way to talk to him? I see a way I can get to him. Give me one moment. Ah, you found me. You have found Danny. Okay? <laughs> is that a Where's Waldo thing? Who is this guy? A token dropped by Danny. I can't use it. I got an all stats up. That's kind of cool. Um... Hmm. That's good. I, I gotta keep my morals. I got Wait, wait. Wait for a fourth party member before you use stat-up books. Just saying. I don't know if this game has, like, permanent... Has, like, temporary party members. 
Oh, it is recommended to spend all of Linky's skills points before continuing. Okay, looks like we got a battle coming up. Um, we have four. Ooh. Oh, I like abilities that do that. Replaces the ability? Oh, that's kind of cool. Power Strike do. It doesn't say. Oh, wait, no, yeah, it does. Um. Cool. Uh, single ability point. Alright. Let's continue on. Not going to wait in line? This is an urgent matter. We can't afford to waste time. Slow down, I can't keep up. Paladin, how dare you interrupt our meeting? I'm sorry, sir, but this is important. I bring you the Radiant Ark. We have plenty of uh, them in the, in the queue outside. You too shall wait your turn. No, Gar uh, Grandmaster, he really is the Radiant Ark, I am certain. He proved his worthiness in battle against a monster, and he was gifted with holy light. I can't say I believe you, Paladin. You do realize that you are the only one here to testify. Yes, but I am speaking the truth. And this boy you have there, is he the one, is he the one I'm supposed to be the Radiant Ark? Yes, his name is Linky. He truly is the Radiant Ark. The room is filled with laughter. That was a good paladin. I have a, I have a scrub. Yeah, I'll have a scribe record it later. Now please leave the chamber. We have a long list of uh, candidates to process, and we can't afford to waste more time. But now, paladin, Weimer. What is it, holy paladin Isabel? Maybe we should listen to paladin Terrace. Are you mad, woman? It won't hurt, will it? It's not our fault, or if if it if it is false, as you believe. The people have only paladin Terrace to blame. You're right. We'll give the boy a shot. I am Holy Lancer Beryl from uh, Luna. I am. Uh, I will be uh, the conductor of the final te uh, trial. Trial of combat. Prepare yourself. You can do it, Linky. Ah, so this is why the game warned me to uh, level up specifically Linky. Okay. So is this just a one-on-one -on -one battle? Does she have like a gimmick or something? I'm gonna guess probably not. You are a paladin though, so let's just do this real quick. I'm under leveled. She's level 6 and I'm level, I think, 4? And that probably... Yeah, okay, good. What does that star do? Hmm. You probably don't have an elemental weakness. But is she almost dead already? Why is she kneeling over? Like, <laughs> that's a lot of damage too. Hold on a sec. Item. You have surpassed my expectations. Time to finish this. What? Where'd she go? <laughs> She's straight up Dragoon. Um. Okay, what now? Uh. Should I guard? That's my best guess, I guess, of what I should do. Oh! Okay, I guess I can't win that. That's enough, Holy Lancer Barrel. Was I supposed to lose that? Violet, come quick. Assume she's the castle nurse. Ah, she, um, he over, uh, he sure overdid it. Will he be okay? Nothing holy cleric Violet can't fix. You got carried away, Beryl. You aren't supposed to use your full strength. My apologies. It's been a while since I had a proper duel. His fighting skills, while lacking polish, are acceptable. I say he passes. He has great potential. Well, it seems he has passed this test. Let's move on to the spiritual test. Holy cleric Violet, commence your test. Understood. Now hold my hands and close your eyes. I will sense your spiritual energy. 
Where am I? Do not worry, my child. Now let my sense uh, let me sense your spiritual energy. This is simply amazing. What is it? Your spiritual energy. It's on scale it's on a scale I haven't sensed before. My mother was a priestess for the yellow shard. Could that explain why? I must tell everyone else. What news, Holy Cleric? Uh, what news, Holy Cleric Violet? He, um, he, is he uh, strong spiritually? His spiritual power is on, is on an inhumane level. He definitely passes this test. Well, the last test will be our final answer. No one has been able to pass this one yet. And what is the test exactly? Contact the Holy Goddess Iron. Now then, read the incantation from which uh, to summon the Goddess Iron aloud. Should you be the Radiant Ark, then uh, she will appear before us. Holy Goddess Iron, hear my plea. The world grows dark and the light heaven fades. The kingdom are in turmoil, its citizens afraid. I, the Radiant Ark, require your aid. Appear before me and bless my crusade. See? It is as I said, he is not the Radiant Ark. Give it some time, Grandmaster. Just give up, Terrace. I said to myself, I'm not the Ark. The boy doesn't even believe in himself. Why are you wasting my time with this asinine charade? You will be demoted this very minute. In fact, henceforth, you are now... Oh. I am Goddess Iron. I have come by your request, Radiant Ark. What the... Goddess Iron! You forgot your place. A true Grandmaster would not have um, ridiculed his subordinates so harshly, nor so hastily as you have done, especially as a well-meaning paladin like Terrace. Furthermore, your lack in patience nearly sent away humanity's only hope of winning this accursed war. I'm sorry, Goddess Iron. Perhaps a new Grandmaster should be appointed, but that's a matter for a later discu uh, discussion. Radiant Ark, I have been waiting. What took you so long? What, uh, why are you calling me the Radiant Ark? My name is Linky. Very well, Linky. What took you so long to contact me? Why should I? I have no interest in talking to you. How dare he? Linky, this is Goddess Iron, the most be benevolent uh, being in the world. Please, show some respect. She speaks as if she knows me, like she's my friend. But if uh, this uh, this was pre um, preordinated, then why did my mother have to die? You have quite the sharp tongue, Linky. Perhaps you should stop waggling it so uh, so you may listen better. That's a good boy. That's patronizing. I have I have been watching over you, Linky, ever since you were born. I have waited for you to contact me for a long time, but you never came until now. By why me? Why am I the Radiant Ark? Because you are the one who will save us all. You are the only one with the power to do so. I don't understand. You will, soon enough. Don't worry. I see you are wearing the pendant I gave you. Keep it with you at all times, okay? I won't be able to help you otherwise. What are you talking about? My mother gave me this pendant, not you. Time, uh, time will tell. But right now, you need, um, you need to concentrate. Is her, is his mother Goddess Iron? <laughs> I'm kind of expecting that plot twist now. The darkness in this world is growing ever stronger. I can't control the, um, the Moria for much longer, as their power grows with each, um, shard they obtain. This war has spread from your world to Elysium, and the holy beings are in distress. Uh, Sir, yeah, Serpris is the um, is the mind be, uh, behind it all. He plans to release Zardon from uh, from his seal and rule both the earth and the heavens. I request the Guild of Light to keep his identity from the Radiant Ark as a secret and aid him in his journey to collect the shards. Yes, of course, Goddess Iron. We are fully committed to helping the Radiant Ark. Thank you. I have full faith you can stop darkness from spreading. I must leave now. Be safe, Radiant Ark. Amazing, the Goddess appeared. My apologies for doubting you, Radiant Ark. Now we must prepare you for your journey to collect the crystals. Holy Knight Isabel, will you please be um, their companion? I will um, I will have to decline, as my other duties need my full attention. I believe my apprentice will be more than capable of protecting the Radiant Ark. Are you sure this is a good idea? Yes, I am certain. Just as certain as the sun coming with the dawn. Very well. Your intuition has never led us astray before. Thank you. I won't let you down. You will need to travel to the kingdom of uh, Fe um, Feyal, in uh, in the uh, in the west of the purple for the purple shard, you will encounter many obstacles on your way there, so be uh, prepared. So we're heading west ultimately. Okay. Before you leave tomorrow, um, the Guild of Light will provide you with the provisions and an uh, official letter for the shards. The Guild of Light is already in possession of the white shard, and this yeah, Serpurus has taken the yellow shard. Now, all of you, please get some rest. The fate of our world is in your hands. We will pray for your success and will provide our support. Such a long day. I'm the Radiant Ark, huh? The story was true after all. Why then? When my mother was fighting for her life, why didn't I have the power to help her? I'm so goddamn weak, and the fate of the world lies on my shoulders. What a joke. 
I need to get stronger, now more than ever. Linky, are you still awake? Yes, you couldn't sleep either, I assume. No, how could I? I'm so worried about tomorrow, but also excited. Me too. But just uh, the um, just the worry part, I know that's a good cause. I know it's a good cause, uh, that, um, that what we do is great. But I can't shake that feeling of, you know, that I shouldn't do it. What do you mean, Linky? I'm thinking, like, why me? Why do I have to do this? Well, you're the Radiant Ark, you know that. I do, but I feel unworthy. Linky. I'm too weak to be the hero that the Radiant Ark is supposed to be, and don't you dare tell me otherwise. I was always the worst um, of us when it came to fighting, and you know that. Even that insufferable ass Derek was stronger than me. I only beat that monster back home because of some glorified power boost. It wasn't my own skill. If I am the Radiant Ark, why am I not, um, why am I not as powerful as the stories say? I'm the goddamn Radiant Ark with the power to save the world, and why couldn't I save my mother? I'm sorry, Lexi. Today has been enlightening. Really, it has. But it opened my eyes in a lot of bad ways, too. I realized that I'm uh, still learning who I am. Who I'm going to... I didn't... Okay. I didn't press um, the key there to advance the dialogue. I guess this just... <laughs> like, yeah, I understand. I do. But I, uh, you need to remember that you're not alone anymore. I'm here for you, and I always will be. You're my... Uh, you are precious to me, Linky. You really are. Even though you're, you've are you only been of us a few years, I feel closer to you than anyone else. Thank you, Lexi. I thank you. You're the most precious thing I have, too, and I'll get stronger for the both of us. Everyone ready to go? Yepers? I'll follow wherever you go, Radiant Ark. Just call me Linky, Terrace. Okay, Linky, then. I've acquired provisions from the Guild of Light. I'm so excited to go. Off to Fe um, Feol. Right, let's go. Thus, Linky was pronounced Radiant Ark by the Holy Goddess Iron. Now Linky, accompanied by the young native Paladin Terrace, uh, oh, wait, young naive Paladin Terrace and Lexi, a close friend wanting to protect him and more, journey off into the world to find the Seven Shards in order to restore the Grand Crystal. They head west to the to first destination, the Kingdom of Faal, to obtain their first, sh uh, their first shard. What awaits them on their journey? Though the shards may be used for peace, so too they can, can they be used for violence in the hands of the evil and corrupt. Why is evil seeking the shards now? What will happen when they obtain all seven? And why do the number of monsters ever increase, even in daylight? Will the world ever be peaceful again? The shards shed their light silently. Oh, you can speed this up. <laughs> I can offer you enormous power, the power to crush all who oppose you. Perhaps you would prefer the, um, the adoration of all your peers. I don't know. It sounds too good to be true. Isn't there... Is Derek turning to the dark side? <laughs> Isn't there someone you care for, someone you love? Yeah, but she loves some idiot instead. Should you embrace the darkness, her love will be yours. She will uh, marvel at your power, enamored and um, willing to your every whim. Give in to the darkness, Lexi. Just say the word. Say the word and she will become yours. I'll do it. It's a deal. Welcome, Dark Knight. Welcome. Ooh. Nice. Before we leave, I would like to visit the Shrine of the First Paladin to receive his blessing for the journey ahead. You may come too if you wish. Sure. Sure thing, Terrace. Thank you. It's in the basement of the Guild of Light. We just left. <laughs> Didn't, um, they say we were going to get a new party member? Huh. Well, regardless, I think that's enough for one episode. I'll see you folks next time. Thanks for watching.